How to Become a Walmart Millionaire Part 2. Hi, I'm Martial Arts Master Bill Fitzpatrick. Now, I want you to remember that as I teach, I am directing my teaching specifically to my senior martial arts students, brown belts and black belts. These are tough, thoughtful men and women of action. They have already proven themselves. They are, they are far from average. Sadly, the overwhelming majority of average people, let's be frank, they have little ambition. They get a job and that job becomes a rut. And very few average people have clearly defined, focused goals. For many average workers, the routines and the friendships, the comfort of knowing how to do a job and the fear of the unknown becomes a web, a a trap, which for them is very difficult to escape. Of course, for my students, you know, the apathy and the fear of average workers creates opportunities for them to shine in comparison. I mean, like it or not, you have to admit that average workers are small thinkers. They don't ever, never think big. How to become a millionaire? <laughs> millionaire? What are, you, what are you, crazy? And even more, become a millionaire working at Walmart? Working at millionaire Walmart in the same sentence? Come on, what are you, insane? No. I am alert and aware. I see that most people at work are risk averse. I see that most people like the cocoon of the status quo. I say that most average people don't like to work very hard. At work, too many average workers are like little drones, living the same boring day over and over and over, month after year. But at least their jobs are, have no surprises, work hard, come on, why should they? How many average workers, now be honest, how many average workers do you know who are really only working hard enough to meet minimal expectations and not get fired? Few of them have any ambition. Most average workers are ruled by circumstance. If they get promoted, it's probably because they lasted long enough to see their immediate boss quit, get fired, retire, or go out of the store, feet first, die. As an Action Principles champion, my students, this is not who you are. You are never going to be an average worker. You're going to work your ass off. You're going to make your bosses look good. You're going you're to love your company. <laughs> what? Love Walmart? Yes, love Walmart. Here is how winners think. Walmart is giving me a job. Walmart is paying me money. Money that I can use to invest to become a millionaire. So, <laughs> start smiling and start loving Walmart. If the store manager wants you to be a greeter for the day, you'll greet. Even if you have a college degree and the store needs you to collect the shopping carts in the parking lot, you never bitch, moan, whine, or complain. You collect the damn carts. You are remarkable. You are indispensable. Now here's what you want. You have a plan. You want to be promoted. Okay, you're an extraordinary employee. The promotions will come. But as a future millionaire, here's what you really want. You want to be able to work 50 hours per week. If there is any chance at overtime, you'll take it. Someone needs a day off, you'll work. Special project needs to be done, you'll work. Inventory, you'll work. Overnight stocking shelves, you'll work. Another Walmart somewhere, anywhere needs help for a day, you'll work. You want those 50 hours. You want 40 hours to cover your bills and spoil those you love. You want 10 hours put aside for your investments. Your investments? 
Yeah, how do you think you're going to become a Walmart millionaire? You will be doing it by investing. Average people work an average number of hours, 40. This is not you. You are above average, and you are ready, willing, and able to work an above average number of hours, 50. This 50-hour work plan, coupled with your investments, this combination is going to make you a millionaire in 20 years or less. So do it right now. Embrace the concept. 50 hours of paid employment. 40 hours to pay your bills, 10 hours for investment. Do it. Embrace it. Right away, you are separating yourself from average people because average people are going to say, what are you nuts? They'll never do this. And even the few who might work overtime are just going to piss away the extra money. You are different. Think differently. You are extraordinary. Okay, on to lesson three, how to become a Walmart millionaire.